I'm naked? Damn, damn! 30? In the Yo, why is the last one 10 minutes? 10 minutes is crazy. We not listening to this whole shit. We not listening to this whole thing. Is Ozzy responding to the only one? No, the thing is just muted so we can listen to the music. Go ahead. Do say what you're gonna say before we before we start. Uh oh yeah, you did ask so we if we can listen to the Drake. I mean we could probably we could probably play a couple tracks if y'all wanna laugh at some shit. Um I'm trying to figure out what songs would be like the best here. Did y'all listen to the album? Victor Vaughn After Dark Victor Vaughn Dark Tracks just don't hit the same. Uh, it depends on who's doing them. It depends on who's doing them. Yeah, it's fire. Yeah, it's bad. Thank you for being very descriptive with your analysis. Okay, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, fuck. I don't even know. Where, where do I start? Let's do the shortest tracks. Like, let's start with, like, Clouds. This is a bad place to start. Let me just hear what the first track sound like. I'm Morgan Freeman. Logic is the GOAT. <laughs> Retire for what? He just got tired of the garbage. It's definitely you. Y'all gotta get off his man, this man dick, okay? Like, I know Morgan Freeman was paid to say that. I do. But. I'm trying to save it. How do I save that? It's not bad. That's a, that's a, you know, it's a, it's a, it's an intro. It's an intro. Get off his dick. It's an intro. Get off his dick. It's an intro. Get off his dick. Um, I feel like I've already listened to Tetris. Oh yeah, we did. We did. We played Tetris a, a couple weeks ago on stream. I'm pretty sure. Um, Am I going to listen to Sofago EP? N no. Well, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. We got to see how we like this. If this if this goes well, then I, I might feel great. You know what I'm saying? I might feel great. Action Bronson. In my lifetime. Let's see what he's talking about. I got game plenty. Talk shit. Reload the semi. Mafia shit. With Juicy J sipping Henny. I saw a guy on the corner getting high. When a spray bullet from a drive-by. Some people cautious, but I'm cautious. Motherfucker round the fastest. I made it through the light despite how dark my past is. Smoking back to back touches. My finger just inches off the button. That'll turn your fucking body into stuffing. My bitch will kick you with strange feet. A thousand roses expertly engraved into the handle of the heat. Carved ice on pre-Columbian queens. Staring at the roof. For the chapel, I showed you mercy. Man, I be smoking mad shit. That's why I'm silly. Stupid motherfucker. You know it's me. Okay. Alright. I just wanna thank God for the life that I got. I got a lot of chains, got a lot of blame. Chill. But money isn't everything. Seen a lot of pain, yeah. I seen a lot. Could have caught that Lamborghini off the lot. Okay, I'm not a fan of the slower logic tracks. Um, generally, they're just, just they're just not my vibe. You know, I don't think Logic has a strong enough voice to pull it off. That isn't to say that you can't like the song or that I'm saying that the song is bad or it's trash. It's just it's not my vibe. You know, Logic's voice slow, not my thing personally. Let's go. Uh, somebody did say Black White Boy. I want to hear what that sound like. See what he talking about. <laughs> Still in the game with you, wetting fools like when the rain hits you. Music, movies, and families, I'm a lane switcher, ready to get you now. So I'm the definition of a try hard, the lyrical miracle guard. Do anything just for the applause. Claiming you the greatest, but is you? I do this for Kenny, do this for Cole, do this shit for the Jizzit and the whole clan for show. I respect this generation, but I need the hardest bars you can provide. I'm taxing you with inflation. You have to do it again. One more. All right, Flex, I hope, you know what? This makes Flex look worse. I'm sorry, it does. Logic is, is doing fine right now. Like, this song is cool. Um, I like this song. Uh, Logic flow wise is going off. Bars, I just I've given up really trying to like really get any like major good like crazy bars from Logic. He's like, what is the what is the word? He's passable. Logic is a passable lyricist at this point. Um, and if I get anything crazy from him, I will be surprised. But Funk Flex popping in, bro, and I and, and knowing how he does niggas when they come up there to freestyle in the interviews, bro, it it makes him look like the he just niggas just be on. 
dick. Oh my god, flex. Fuck. He didn't even say nothing. You talking about you you, you gotta do it again for the niggas to think what fluke? He didn't say nothing yet for you to say this, bro. Get off his dick. Y'all get off his dick too. You get off Logic's dick. It's not he's not terrible. Cause this is a good song. But flex, bro, get off that nigga dick, bro. Fuck. He gonna keep popping in. I know he gonna keep popping in. I'm trying to slice open my veins just to feel some. Spill my blood on the page, blood on the leaves, blood flowing down my arm from the heart of my sleeve. Hey, fuck rap, let's get it. Everything that I could rap about already said it. It's a new chapter in the country, ripping the raptor. The realest I've ever been is far from sag after the industry too cutthroat. They less focus on the talent and more focus on the upvote. Breaking down on stage, that shit I can't evade. I open up about my feelings, they call me a faggot. Fuck you, I had it. Mentality. Bro, like, come on, dog. Nobody said that, bro. Like, who who said that? Who said that, bro? <laughs> bro, who said who said that, dude? Who who said it, bro? You gonna you gonna you gonna you gonna take the most extreme? Well, not the most extreme. You gonna take one of the more extreme? things that you see like is it reasonable for you to actually look at that word first of all you being who you are and be like oh my god i gotta take that one personally out of all the the, the tweets and the reddits that i've read about myself this one guy with an account that nobody fucking gives a shit about probably with like two likes said this and you like oh you know what that's what i gotta put in the song no you don't it, it, i swear to you it probably was not like that dude it was not that deep for you to put it in the song <laughs> it just wasn't it just wasn't dude it just wasn't he was shattered wanna know why y'all retired because i was uninspired try something different and they say i'm not the same me you could never tame me i'd rather fail trying something new than doing the same shit every day fuck you I don't know, bro. Like, cause I'm, <laughs> I'm prime. <laughs> I don't, I don't mind this song. Um, it's it's actually a good Logic song, uh, with the exclusion. It's just like, what do you what do you call that? Making a making a mountain out of a molehill. It's like this this that he. <laughs> come on, bro. The bars are not terrible. They're not terrible. It's just they're passable. And then when you have to have, we got to listen through this part of the song also. It's like, damn, my nigga, you decided to put that in there only for, for like, passable bars? At least with Kendrick, it was like a conversation that was started, bro. Like, what what provoked that? I don't I don't know. Uh, Let's move to, I think we already listened to Bleed It. What about LaDonda? LaDonda? Is this a con? No, 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 it's not. It's not, it's not. I was, I was joking, I was joking, I was joking. <laughs> Michael Rappaport is not actually about to be on this album, right? Oh, fuck. Vinyl Days 3, bitch. Hey, yo, last album on Def Jam. Now, where the fuck's at? Independent now, smear they face in my nutsack. Sign with another major, now nah, no chance. That's like Chicago with no chance. Not a chance. Accomplice not worrying about it. I like those chance bars. Those chance bars are cool. Get the homie Egon, he sent a hundred vinyl Fuck mixing the album, two track, that's the final Anthony Fontano, your plaid shirt wear a motherfucker I used to hate you, cause you shit on my music Used to fantasize about murdering you Till we got friendly, and I realized you wasn't ever trying to end me You said I built an amazing fan base and career I'm successful, and I'm fucking worthy to be here It meant a lot, friend or not, honestly What what is that that thing? It was a there was the SpongeBob episode, bro. It's just it's a it's an episode for everything. What is nigga like? I forgot he was so cheap that he made someone unwatch the TV that they had already consumed. He like reversed the shit from their eyes and put it back into the screen. I really wish I could do that with my ears right now for this song. I think it's fine to be uh now that like he he sees that you know uh fantano was never like trying to come at his career like end him or anything like that 
but it's just like there's a it's a sm it's a, it's it's just like a it's a more it's a smoother it's a less cringe way to do this to say that I understand like what you were trying to do you know it's a, it's just a less cringe way to do this you know personally um but I'm not one to tell someone how to how they should express you know how they feel about another person is just uh wow. I didn't know it was that deep. I didn't. Nigga said I'm next. I didn't know it was that deep. Uh, it's wow. <laughs> he said he wanted to kill. Her. No, okay. Uh, yeah, it's. I mean, not, and that's not even a wrong, that's, I'm not, that's not even the, the, the part about the song that's just, like, weird. I mean, it is, don't get me wrong, like, being that upset about somebody's opinion, sure. And this is something that he's talking about, like, this was a crazy person that he was being, you know what I'm saying? He's evolved from this individual, you know what I'm saying? So, cool, but, uh, I just, I, I think it's more sad, it's more sad for me to imagine what place Logic was in that, a conversation with Fantano is what would need to happen or need to occur for you to realize that you have a lot of good shit going on as far as, you know what I'm saying? Your career, your fan base, um, you supporting yourself. I didn't know that you need to, you know, have that dialogue or Fantano would need to, or anyone would need to tell you that, you know what I'm saying? Why be feature necessary? They diss you on therapy music. No, they don't. I've listened to therapy music, bro. Fantano saved his career. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, I mean, this is... It, it, it's heartwarming to see he came from this. But it's also just like... What was going on? Like, what was that bad? That... Some random dude talking about your music... The same guy needed to tell you that you're... You're doing great, and his his words aren't going to affect your trajectory whatsoever. That's what a lot of people need to understand, bro. Like, just because a nigga say he don't like your music, and the video he uploads about you get a couple hundred thousand views, your career is still going to skyrocket if it's going to skyrocket. Nobody give a fuck about what they saying. It don't matter. It's just people who want to have a conversation about some shit. It ain't, it ain't that deep. It is not this deep. It's just not. I'm sorry. But I can't tell somebody else that. I'm just speaking for myself. Um, what is the next song? Let's see. Let's see. Aaron. Jo well, I gotta finish this one. I remember commenting on rap genius threads. I remember arguing on ready hip hop heads. I'm sitting sitting sit the same kid I was with a love for hip hop. Now I just got a bigger buzz. Okay. So that kind of that kind of explains it then. It kind of explains it. He was he was a uh, what do you call it? it was a form dweller. He was a form dweller, and so he started putting out his own shit, and he takes what they say to the degree of, like, or takes it to heart, basically, I guess. I know I know it's lame. I know it's lame, but it's real at the end of the day. You could say it's lame, but it's real, I suppose. You don't want to be the, you don't want to be the nigga that gets money, and then it's just like, you know what, I'm too good for all of this shit. Like, I'm glad the logic isn't that, but I'm sorry, bro. If I got that much money, it's like, it's so many other activities that I'm going to be like, it's so many other things that I'm going to be into at that point. Personally, personally, though, I can only speak for myself. I can only speak for myself. Um, Michael Rappaport, bro. Fuck. What could this nigga have to say, bro? He has the worst takes in human history. MC Bobby, MC Nobody Gives a Shit. It's Michael Rappaport. Yo, I know you asked me to do a skit on your album, and I told you, yeah, I would do it. I said I was a fan. I was lying, okay? Um, I'm not doing a fucking skit on your album. Bro, like, I hear him breathing, dude. Like, Michael Rappaport is the whitest man in the, in the world. I hear him breathing while he's, while he's talking. That's like, that should be illegal. Dude, 
no one cares, man, you four-eyed fuck. Get yourself some auto-tunes. I will block you, you four-eyed biracial motherfucker, you, you half-coked cock. Yeah, alright, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Don't worry about it, don't worry about it, it's fine. Um, therapy music, y'all already know my thoughts on it, you know. Uh, y'all said listen to Nardwar and listen to Needle Drop. We're going to listen to those two. I'm going to try to pick a couple more, and then we're going to call it for this album. Um, lot, You know, I, I, it's from what I can tell, musically, uh, Logic is paying attention to everything, or used to. I hope he's not anymore. I really hope he's not. It's just like, when you, when you really put... We, Rogue One? Okay, we're gonna listen to Rogue One. Rogue One 2. So these three, and then I'm gonna pick another one, and then we're gonna call it. My logic, it's Nardwar. Nardwar is such a good dude. Please keep on sampling in the free world. Do, do, do. Turn me up. Yeah, turn the whole shit up. Yeah, loud as fuck. What's the difference between you and me? Came from nothing, now I'm rocking Louis V. Suck my dick, it's Doc D. I'm the greatest rapper in the multiverse. That's why I got a million multis in a verse. Connected on the block like Bluetooth parent. Steady on my grind, peep the parents. I'm a road ghost, I'm out this bitch, watch me coast. Oh shit. As you can see. These transitions are really good though. I'm not gonna lie about that. These transitions are really, really good. From what I can tell, I've only I've only heard like the two so far. Um, cool track, you know. Logic is like, you know what I think about this? Well, not this album, but just in general, Logic's career. I don't think he was ever emulating the people that he was emulating because he wanted to like get big off of some shit that they already did first. I really think that Logic reminds me of that dude or that little kid that puts the mask on and really feels like he is the superhero that he is you know uh pretending to be in that moment you know what i'm saying and so he really feels it you know when he when he's when he's doing these like emulations and he's putting forth these ideas from other people i really feel like he is like real life embodying his actual heroes like these are people who mean like the world to him and i don't i don't mind that uh is it is it is it corny of course at his age but is it endearing yes like it's endearing and it's and it's and it's adorable to an extent. Um, is that say Doja Cat? That's crazy. Uh, let's let's listen to this one and then we are gonna get like two actual songs. Like, I don't know if Rogue One is another skit. I don't know what the fuck is going. There are a lot of skits here, but I don't think overall this is a very long album. Yes, yeah, an hour and twelve minutes, so it's just a lot of skits. Um, so I yeah, I would be able to leave you a message just like this. What what is the general? tone of the other people are they all like leaving you voice messages skits like everyone's just calling you and like leaving a voice message i want to i want to contribute to the consistency of your album if, if i do involve myself in it i want to be the one guy who's doing the one different i, I, I want to understand the concept i want to i want to if, if if i'm there <laughs> if i'm on your record it's not for my ego that you have i'm there to serve the vision <laughs> chill chill <laughs> So, uh, just let me know what the answer to those questions are. Yeah, I mean, obviously he's joking. That, that was funny. That was funny. Uh, what is this noise? I think it's a voice note. I think it's a voice note. Yeah, that's funny. That's funny. Um, Rogue One, y'all said Rogue One, and then Clouds, okay? Oh, man. <laughs> okay, y'all picking all skits for me to listen to is crazy. What did the kick it, give a fuck about a bitch? Was with him for a decade, now we off without a hitch. My cryptocurrency is in the seven figures, my niggas ready to come and get us. Fuck with us, it's me and all my hitters. Wow, Logic two things never rap about crypto and and, and the second thing logic actually sl slid nigga in there very subtly and like i'm sure niggas won't even notice that was like the most subtle nigga i think logic has ever slid in a, in a verse ever 
That was great. He can say that, of course. Biracial Bobby. Made a couple pop songs, made a hundred million gross, made a life for myself. For every night I need a toast. I've been whipping that bronco, bumping that murder. What's the case now? I'm giving it up for the real motherfuckers that love rap. No cap. Retire for a minute now. I'm back. Watch with that boy. Right here, right here. Bro, flex, please go somewhere, bro. This is a good song. I like Rogue One. Rogue One is like my favorite so far. That's a really good song from Logic. I think that's Tribe too that he put in a song. Um, that's good. I like that. That's like his best one in a, in a, a cool little minute. And it's condensed. You know, don't oversay his welcome. He actually could have went longer if he wanted to on this track, but th that was good. This was cool. Uh, what was the other one? Okay. <laughs> okay, that sounds crazy. I'm not going to lie, that sounds crazy. Uh, you said 10 years, right? Where Where is it? Oh, you know, you said clouds. I can give a fuck to sit you on, but I'm really trying to put you on. Finally got this bitch, I'm finally gone. I was going to hit the road, but I'm staying longer. Doing whatever the fuck I want to do when I want to do it. People thinking they know it, but they... I'm sorry? With my son and his baby mama. I was going to hit the road, but I'm... The son's baby mama? Or did I hear that wrong? No, his son and... <laughs> no, this, I was just wondering, like, did he say my son and his baby mama? Am I stupid? I think I'm really stupid. I don't I don't get it. He just chatting? I'm not going to look too much into it. I'm not. I just, I swear to God, he just said... <laughs> I I'm not even on dick. I'm not even on dick. I'm just confused. I was just confused just now. I swear to God. Chilling with my son and his baby mama. His son means his friend. Oh, okay. There you go. That's all I needed to hear. That that's not that's not what the fuck you meant. You y'all are lying to me. I shouldn't have asked chat. Trying to don't listen to music on stream. Peace. Fuck the shit you on, but I'm really trying to put you on. Low key trying to get trophies with my dogs. Surely you'll see my face smiling on the front of a billboard soon. While I'm on the E-way, I wish life was easy. In a very long time, bro. Best track he's made in a long time. That's a really good song. He's been putting out so many great records for such a long time. And he really, you know what I'm saying? Like, niggas sleep on currency at the end of the day. He's just consistent. Currency is the definition of consistency. Like, fuck. Like, nobody's going to talk about how he dropped more entertaining records for a while. I'm not going to say it. Never mind. Fuck it. See? Because sometimes you just go too far. I didn't really go too far with what I was about to say, but you know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. Uh, you said Carnival? There's a track called Carnival with AZ. Okay, okay. Let me see. Let me see this one. I'll play this one. I've already listened to Orville. Um, wait, did I? Yeah, I did. And you said the room with RZA? We might have to do that one. Yeah. I like this. It's like, like, creeping. Okay, we're going to do one more track for, for Logic after this. After Carnival. You can either choose, you know, introducing Nezzy. Or it'll be Portal 1. Which one? I support Cuck Nation. What the fuck? Nezzy. Where is 10 years? Oh, I dog, I was looking for this track for so long and my eyes, I just could not see it. I literally could not see it. All right, let's 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 get this one out the way. No more. <laughs> what makes an MC? Let's trace this entry. For me, once a brace left states in a frenzy. Straight with 10 G's to vase and Bentley's. School from the jump to lace and gently. Balance both feet on the concrete. Calm and meek, throw that heat into my arm. Reach. Life's a oh. bitch, we knew that. Guns drawn with the loot at. Chilling at the crib, up in loop pay and loop pack. Go berserk on the beat machine work till I'm spacing out like Captain Kirk. Wanna know my network? God level the rebel, nobody could rebel. I'm sick as the devil. I'm Dwayne Johnson, you fucking pebble. Start up from the bottom, the basement, the fucking garbage. Now I'm on top, and you talking shit? Hell nah, bitch. These pussies castrated and faces exacerbated. Spin Why does it. What do you say? Why does Sirens actually sound good? Because it's mixed well, number one. And it's smooth. Smooth as fuck. He knows when to turn it up. It's not like throughout the whole shit, but he know when to turn it on and when to bring it back. And that's just great for this track. 
all in all, this is just a good. This is just a good song. It's all. It's all. It's all homages. You know, homages for for Logic. That's really what it is. He's giving the people that he's featuring to a good space in a good, you know, um, world to rap in. You know, he's not putting them in any awkward positions, you know what I'm saying? So he just kind of meets them with the energy that they most consistently and most often give, which is uh, a, a good choice, I think, musically that he did for the album so far. I rip your intestines out of your abdomen through your asshole and choke you with them. I'm sick of the venom. You know I fucking got them. Leave you stuttering to get, get, get shit out like Joe Biden. I really did. And everything they say is true when you get really big. I made it. That is a verse. That, oh wow. God. Flex, flex, funk, flex, flex. Just brother, 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 brother bear, brother man, brother man. You gotta go. You gotta go. If I hear you one more time on this album, bro, it's gonna be a problem, bro. It's gonna be a problem. You gotta go. I, I, he, he's by far the most annoying part of the album so far. <laughs> I like every time his voice pops up, I just immediately, like, I wince. Like, it's, it's one of those, it's like, it's like nails at a chalkboard every time he speaks. I can't, I can't take it. I really can't. Um, Y'all said introducing Nezzy. Okay. Hold on, hold on. In 10 years from Royce, and then we'll call it. Okay. Um, all in all, that guy talking, you mean flex? What the fuck? Oh, it's not gonna stop. Yeah, yeah. It can't continue. This nigga said it's not gonna stop after I literally asked him, please stop. It's not gonna stop. Yeah, yeah. All right, I got it. can't you. continue. Hey, why you rapping so scared to put others on? Any musician I find, I let them shine like Tron. Watch it spread like Omicron. Bring in a doom like Victor Vaughn. Smash your nuts, just your nuts on a dresser like Raekwon. Village of Greenwich, a minute and feeling infinite with it. If you want it, then come. That Victor Vaughn line was cool. That Victor Vaughn line was cool. I don't know why. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. I'm going to skip over it, bro. I'm gonna, skip I'm gonna get it steady in the gym, nothing but curls like I'm Hasidic. The game told me we was just some rapping motherfuckers, word to Compton. All the way to Gaithersburg, my stomping. I'd rather be loved by legends with careers that really last than accepted by some weirdo on YouTube with a podcast. Know that they inferior. Helping other musicians is my criteria. Now let me pass the mic to Nezzy, show him something well, serious. Deliberately okay, before we get to Nezzy. <laughs> he said Sean has two episodes of a podcast, he counts. I don't have a podcast. Um, I don't see. I don't know. Like I do like I do like just shitting on criticism too. You know, if he decided to just be like, you know what, fuck all these niggas that have to have anything negative to say about my music or anything negative to say about me, like that would be okay too. But it's just like when you say on on your album that you're past those things and you're past those emotions, and then you still kind of you take it in this way, I guess. It's it's just a little it's a little passive aggressive. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little passive aggressive. I'd rather him just be like, you know what, fuck Joe, fuck you know all these other weird niggas, whoever whoever it is you want to say fuck to, just say fuck them niggas, bro. Just say fuck them. Just say fuck them. Fuck you. Fuck you. Like just like Tupac did. Just say fuck you, nigga. Just say fuck you, dude. Just say it. You gotta just just say it with your chest. Name somebody hot as me, Prodigy, probably be on your favorite rapper in another three. Watch the way I do this, murder on acoustics, run fire gun, cause on wax I be ruthless. My city like a motherfucking GI, my niggas got a whole lot of money like B.I. Oh my god, what does this song remind me of? Fuck, I cannot think of it. Shit, it's on the tip of my fucking nuts, and I just can't draw it out i can't think of it right now oh my god i'm mad i'm mad i'm mad a biatch my fucking nickname a chick that can't rip instrumentally it's my other disdains i be with the goose told you i'm a fool bobby ain't the only rapper running with the tool i'm crew out getting smoked and if i'm not the illest who you feeling is jokes huh yes <laughs> bro bro flex leave I like that. I like that one a lot. Introducing uh, Nezzy. Also, pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Personally, personally, I'm fucking with that. I'm fucking with that. Um, What was I saying before? I like I like these songs, right? These, these songs that we've played, for the most part. 
in the future, because I don't know if he's going to do it. You know, he said, I think he says that he's out of retirement on the album from what we've heard so far. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm about to do 10 years. I'm about to do 10 years. Whoa, that sound. I'm about to play 10 years. Not do. Whatever. Um, I hope in the future, like when he does this, he can uh, add, you know, the newer generation. You know, I like paying homage to, you know, classical hip hop. Well, not classical, but classic hip hop, you know, the, the roots and shit like that. I like paying that type of homage, but like also like kind of show what it turned into. Cause what, what, what we ended up getting later on, the talent that we ended up getting later on from the things that you're referencing need to be acknowledged too. You know, you got to highlight those things too. Like it's, 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 it's incredible talent and classics here, obviously, but you really got to highlight that new shit that's coming out too. So you can be like at least tapped in musically. So niggas don't just look at you and be like, oh, he's that, you know, um, he's that old nigga rapper, basically. Because this is old nigga rap right here. It sounds good, though. It sounds seasoned. It's, it's, it's very mature for the most part. Um, it's got something to say, usually. You know, got some bars. Um, just add some new, some new shit to it, too, you know. It can't all be back in the day type shit. I mean, Russ, I guess, Wiz, I guess, but, you know, I mean, like, put them, put them new niggas on, too, you know, it's some new niggas that fuck with you, I know it is, Portal 1 is simple by Brandon Ruck, okay, whatever, uh, let's do 10 years, come on. Egon got the Latash in the cellar. My rhymes affect the game, man. Yella, I ain't asked for 50 million like I was gay. I shot the video for Tetris in the hallway. Spit the verse on the air conditioner. Listen up, dishing up. Write lyrics is off the wall. No Egyptian. Flowing in cold, peep the encryption. Street word the currency. Peep the urgency. Logic bringing boom back back. This shit is the resurgency. Okay. Hey, yo, 10 years ripping in the game with the brights on. Bro, you gotta stop. You gotta stop doing that. Chat, you definitely can get off his dick, number one. That's true, Jake. But just because they don't like it doesn't mean that they're preventing him from doing what he wants to do. I hate that criticism. Like, they're allowed to not like the song, and that's fine. But that doesn't mean them disliking it is, is them preventing him from making what he wants. The song is already out. It's already released. We're listening to it. He did what he wanted to do, and now people are doing what they want to do. They're giving their opinion about it, and that's fine. You know what I'm saying? I like it. I think it sound fire, personally. But if chat don't fuck with it, they, they ain't gotta fuck with it. Ten years hit after hit, I got the sights on. Ten years on Def Jam, I kept the lights on. What? Keeping the lights on is crazy. The pain is practice just sit back, cause it's your game with the groupie. This ain't no acting, reenacting scripts, this ain't a real movie. This Are you talking about chat being on my dick? Well, same thing applies. They allowed to criticize me for still listening to this album. But I'ma still, I'ma do what the fuck I want. They not prevent me from doing shit. Appreciate it though. Trying to stop the street shit, exhuming kings, slugs to whoever the fuck that loves you. On all their top five lists, just probably not B dots. Yo, B dot be doing niggas dirty with his lists, and for no reason, unprovoked ass lists out of nowhere, bro. I be like, what am I reading? B dot is wild. Meets an unstoppable force, unbreakable. They're going at it, head to head, toe to toe. This is the most gangster shit I've ever seen. Logic and Jizza, this is an unparalleled match. I'm not doing it, I'm not doing it. We're gonna stop there. We're gonna stop there. We're gonna stop there. Uh obviously, like I said, I'm not gonna I don't really have a plan to talk. I mean I might talk about I don't think I don't think I really want to. I might. I don't. I don't know. I'm not gonna review this album, like formally review it or anything like that. I might talk about it a little bit on the channel, but uh, I'm gonna obviously finish listening to it before I give any final thoughts. But yeah, I mean, I'm trying to come to terms with like how I feel about it. It, it definitely feels like what he wanted to do. You know what I'm saying? What he wants to do. I'm not done listening to it once again, but it doesn't feel like you know. That same level of trying to prove anything. It's just like, you know, I think if you were to ask Logic back when he first started rapping what his dream would be, this is his out uh, this is what the album would be. This is his dream. To to work with every artist who's influenced him and, and helped him in any way and gotten him through a, a tough time or, or, or some you know, or some deep shit. 
I feel like him making music with all these people is his dream as a rapper, his dream as an MC. So if he got his dream and this is what it looks like, then I'm happy for him. I am. Uh, I it's, it's hard to look at this as, as like a part of his discog but he wanted to do it he's out of retirement now he about to start doing his thing again I assume and that is what it is but for me like I said my, my, my personal opinion I still feel like you know for me his album or his, his, his discog for me kind of ends at no pressure for me, it don't have to end that way for anyone else. Obviously, he's still, he's still going to keep dropping music. But, uh, you know, we'll see if he can top it. You know what I'm saying? We'll see if he can top it. This isn't this isn't bad, though. This is a pretty decent, pretty, pretty, pretty all right uh, listen from what I from what I see so far. For the most part. 